What's up? I hope you're having an amazing day. It is Lenny C with Lenny C's Food Review. And we are going to, uh, I always say special, but I, I really mean it. Let's go in and take a look. Oh, we right on time. David, so guys, this is my friend Tish. Hi, guys. Tish is a part of the Irie Nation crew. Yes, I am. To, to, if you ever need anything when you come in, Tish will take great care of you. As you can see, great setup, great music, great vibes. And then also, if you want to relax, there's a nice cozy bar up front. TV. Nice establishment. And the food, wait till you taste the food. Let's get going. Tish is going to, she whipped up something special for us. Let's check it out. Okay, so here's the mac and cheese. Mm -mm. You look at that texture on that. You can tell that's done right. Mm. Mm. Nice and sweet, cinnamon, perfect texture. Chicken. Yeah, so this is the Jamaican curry chicken. Mm. Look at that curry, spices in that sauce. Maybe carrots, mm -hmm. and potatoes. Mm -hmm. That's what it's So this is brown stew chicken. Mm. Yeah. Good old Jamaican brown stew chicken. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know it could look like that. <laughs> yes, it does. It's so savory and and done the right way. It almost looks like beef. It's nice and dark. Yep. Mm. <laughs> yes. Oh, look at the eyes. Sawfish, banana, dumpling, and I think that's bread fruit. I never had bread fruit. I gotta ask Tish. So excited. This is my first time having Aki and Sawfish. Mm. Mm. 
Oh, that's so flavorful. Oh my goodness, that's so flavorful. The Aki, it's almost like the texture that's in between the egg, the scrambled egg and the avocado. That is buttery, yo. This Aki and saltfish is amazing. Be careful with the bones because it's real saltfish. This is traditional. And this is Kalaloo. <laughs> the saltfish. You can tell it's been salted. Nice and jerky texture, but they moistened it up with the aki to make it like the perfect balance. Onions, pepper, you taste the heat, scotch bonnet. Yeah, this real good. Love cabbage. Green. I guess they don't listen, huh? No, they don't. Hey, okay. yeah, sweet potato. Mac and cheese. The whole shebang. Just for Lenny C's full review. Y'all ready to eat some of that? Uh, Rice and cheese. Uh, mm -hmm. Rice and cheese. Uh, what kind of soup you have on it? Chicken. Chicken. Chicken right. Yeah. No realer than this. Right. No realer than this, right, right. guys? Right. Mine. <laughs> Matter of fact, let me show you guys something. Look at the depth of flavor in here. You're gonna see the smokiness around that bone ring and that tender fat. That's something that just makes it all come together. There it is. Look at that. Mm. Mm. Uh oh. Definitely not losing that. Uh, mac and cheese is amazing. The, the oxtails. Okay. I'm more on the sweeter side, just slightly sweet, smoky, the classic oxtail taste. That fat ring is there, the tender, stringy meat is there, the bone ring, perfect. That curry goat is amazing. The flavor on that, I can't even describe it. It's curry and spicy, but it has so much flavor. It's tender and juicy and perfect texture. That curry goat is amazing. Now let's get to the veg and sides. Cabbage cooked to perfection.
Monica, give me a minute. Some real live eaters here at Irene Nation. The locals, they've been here before and they like the food. So we're just gonna have get their opinion on what's good and what they like here. Let's check out their place. My food looks so plain compared to you. Yeah, I mean, I got the kind of chicken. She's <laughs> running away from meat with bones, which is okay because they have veggie options, mac and cheese. This is Casey. Hi. And Casey, mac and cheese, what do you feel about it? It's really good. Um, I like it when it's hot and fresh. Texture right. Yeah, the texture is good. Tastes like good. Good. There we go. Mm -hmm. Like southern mac, right? It's not like the thrown together in the box stuff. Right, right. Mm. What do you think? <laughs> right down the money. Always like that. Consistent as always. Yes. Yeah, yeah. With Casey, we also have Sierra. So Sierra, <laughs> what did you select today? Um, I got the curry chicken, and the rice and peas, and the mac and cheese. Okay, which so is that's my favorite thing from here. Let's, let's, let's have you take a bite. <laughs> oh. Just like you remembered it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I read nation, guys. This food is for real. Look at the texture. You can't lose in here. Whatever you pick is good. Mm -hmm. And the ladies kept it legit. They have the Jamaican pineapple. You gotta wash it down right. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys. Enjoy your meal. Right. Thank you. Yeah. All right. So here we have Selena. I was so happy that she uh, came in to eat because this is Selena's first time 
eating Irene Nation's food. <laughs> so what she ordered was the oxtail. With collard greens and the rice and the peas. Mm. Oops. <laughs> uh oh, she's excited. I'm excited. Right. First time, let's see, let's see what you think. All right, get some rice and peas. Let's see what you get in that white. It tastes really good. What, what hit you first? Mm, the seasonings hit me first. Mm. Then the chicken hit me. <laughs> well, not the chicken, but the oxtail, right? The oxtail, there we go. <laughs> hey, it's so good. You don't know what meat it is, the oxtail. But it's really good because I'm happy right about now. It's good. So, so guys, you heard it first. First time trying it. We're not faking for the camera. She's never been here. It had the same reaction I had. Mm -hmm. But she spilled a lot less food on herself than I did. <laughs> this is good. Make sure y'all come in. You heard it first for Selena. And you know it's good because she's digging in. Thank you. Enjoy your food. You know I had to get a patty, guys. You know I had to show you that. Ooh, it's hot, too. This will let you know when the patty is money. You bust it open, and that meat is moist. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That lets you know the patty is busted. Oh, it's burning me. Fresh all day, they don't get dry. If you need anything at Irie Vibes, you make sure you ask Tish. She's the one that made all this possible today for us. So we really want to show our appreciation. Make sure when you come into Irie Vibes, you also say, Lenny C's Food Review. And when you mention that, Tish might throw you a little favor. We'll, we'll see how you act. <laughs> so everybody say thank you. Thank you, Tish. And we'll be seeing you soon. All of this food. I did what I could, guys. Y'all gonna have to come help me next time. If you would like to be a part of Lenny C's food review, drop me a uh, drop me an info in the comments. We'll try to set it up. Local to Charlotte. Let's do something new, Charlotte. You know we're gonna find something good, have some extra for you. You might want to be a part of it. I'll put you on as a cameo. Let's go. If you see it, drop a note in the comments. Well, that pretty much does it for our review of Irie Nation. Um, I hope you guys really could appreciate all oh, that great food they have to offer seeing all the herbs spices and care and time that it takes into preparing the dishes that they give you um you, you you're served pretty fast but man when you see what's going on behind the scenes you really can appreciate uh, why that food tastes so good um one of my favorites there is the curry goat that was one of the most flavorful and tender meats out of all of them even though every meat there is amazing so i definitely would recommend the uh, curry goat a special thank you to tish i really appreciate uh you allowing us to showcase the highlights restaurant and uh, without your support it wouldn't have been a successful review so thank you i'm also a special shout out to donovan so once again i hope you enjoy and i'll see you again soon Somewhere where food is in the room and anything left will be uncivilized. <laughs>